Uh, question for Lavelle, and even Vinny, you're getting a bit swole too. Uh, <laughs> are you training with? Uh, no, you, no, seriously, I, I saw your your training. Your lower body has like become like a, a pyramid almost. Like that's good. I'm actually low, working my lower body too because just it's just it's much e not easier, but it, it gives you better chances of just hanging in there. You don't want to be that guy who's like this. Yes, 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 yes. So I see guys at my gym. That's everyone. And, and it's like, <laughs> like, uh, like from the side, and he's just like curling, and he's a beast. And then I look, and his his arm is is thicker than his leg, and I'm like, that's not good. Not a good look. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> yeah, well, no, I'm, I'm not. I don't think of it of oh, bro skips legs day. I, I, I don't care about that. It's for me. No. It's that's how you get injured. And sweat. Yeah, well, especially when you're that like. You know, there's not a balance to your your body. Yeah. There's going to be some problems. But also, your that means that your legs. Mm, well, let's look at it from a wrestling perspective. Wrestling, a lot of especially what we're doing, it's a lot of pressure and drive. Yes. You're actually using your legs to put the weight into the person. Yes. You're not just right. using your arms. Then you're just using straight raw, you know, muscular muscular force and and power. But that's going to burn out. Yeah. Right. So you gotta you gotta use your legs to drive, especially if you look at uh, the huck wolf, right? Yes. So your legs, your glutes, they have to be developed. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, I would say the most important are legs. You know, we'll just say lower body in general, all of it, and your uh, back, your back and your traps, which it connects to your back, obviously. But I would say all of that in your lower body. And having a thick core, yeah. Having yeah. that small waist and stuff that looks good for modeling, you know, <laughs> the girls like it. But for wrestling like this, where there's no weight divisions, your core has to be ready to kind of hold some stuff. You know what I mean? Yes. Um. So how do you get yeah. that? From heavy lifting from heavy squats, right? Here's my question: If you can mm -hmm. give, um, obviously, uh, coaching advice is, is expensive, but if you can give the guys, <laughs> that's right now. That's if you can give the guys three to four exercises in the gym, what would they, what would they be? Mm. Squats is there. Squats for sure. Matter of fact, I would even say this: don't do deadlifts. Okay. I would even say don't do deadlifts unless it's lighter weight or like heavy single leg deadlifts. Why? Romanian. I know saying, but, huh? Romanian. Romanian as well, yeah, with like dumbbells, but I wouldn't do necessarily like these. Everyone wants to do heavy uh, deadlifts with you know the barbell. Um, I'm not actually. It's great to do, but what I'm trying to say is, so many injuries happen in wrestling mm -hmm. from deadlifts. I mean, here alone. I mean, no lie to you. The last two years, a quarter of the team has back problems because they've been deadlifting heavy, mm -hmm. right? And because think about what you're doing with grappling, you're constantly using your back. This is why most grapplers got smaller chests in their back, like they're like monkeys, right? If you look up from the back, because they're constantly pulling and they're lifting. So I would say, um, okay, okay, squats, cleans, specifically hang cleans, because you gotta generate the the, the force. You gotta generate from from a smaller distance, from a shorter distance. Mm. Um, uh, don't worry about snatches and stuff like that. So hang cleans, squats. Um, Mm. What else? You were doing I mean, a, a type of squat where the barbell was resting. Oh, zercher squats. Like, well, when I say squats, I mean I mean front squats, back squats, zercher squats, hang cleans. Um, we can do presses, overhead presses, even like whether it's a push press, strict press, jerks, and you can do it even from the clean or like a thruster where you squat and you go up. Um, I would say doing a lot of rowing is really like I more than anything I do a lot of rowing and lap motions right like lap pull downs and stuff from very dynamic grips and i'm putting different stuff on there i'm constantly pulling here here one arm wide short hands turn hands turn hands you know what i mean and uh i do that probably the most because what are we doing when we're jacket wrestling it's constantly pulling mm. right mm. belt pulling right. right so um i would say these are some of the most important Things to do. There's also a, a technique, an uh, exercise I do. You've probably seen on, on Instagram posted where I'm like doing almost like curls like this. Yeah. I really, I really like these, and people don't understand like the significance because 
They think I'm just curly. I don't give a damn what my arms look like. I, I don't care about that. I care if I can. What I'm doing when I'm doing this is learning how to, whether it's from the lat or whether it's an arm drag or whatever, I'm learning how to pull the person, or even if I'm clenched, right? Yeah. If I'm clenched here. Yeah. Like, what you're noticing, you can sit for a second, I'm sure. I tell them. I'm going up and back. Arm but when drag. I go back, yes, when like I go the arm back, drag. yes, like the arm drag, I'm actually squeezing my lat, right? So I'm working everything, my shoulders, my bicep, my, my forearms, my core, my lats, my back. I'm doing everything at mm. one time. Now, I'm not saying stiff, I'm staying loose into that to this motion. And this, you see a lot of wrestlers do it with the bands, right? Bong, bong, yeah. bong, right? I'm literally doing that, but with heavier weights. And I tell you, that, that plays a tremendous effect on my ability to, like, when I get underhooks, and especially when I, boom, like, people start moving, right? Mm. Um, so I, I would say, again, you combine that with press, different presses, different cleans, different squats, um, and different rows and stuff, and you're going to develop quite well in terms of strength. Right. And uh, to keep balance, why don't y'all go ahead and throw some bench press in there? I don't really care about it that much, but just to keep your keep your body balanced, because if not, right. you're going to start turning like a turtle. Right. Right. So yeah. and also bench press, if you look at it from a certain perspective, it's good for that pushing motion. Right. Because right. some people style, boom, boom, oh, I go under. I'm, I just made a video about this, you know, where I'm going in. I'm, I'm going in. I'm kind of just moving people. Uh, because you got to know how to put pressure too. I think a lot of small guys don't do that, especially when there's uh, no weight divisions. Yes. So they're only used to like pull, 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 lean, lean, lean. Yes. Right. So you got to have everything. Mm. And uh, I'm I'm gonna leave in a, just a bit, but um, my my last question to both of you is, what are your ambitions for the near and far future? You give your yours first. All right. Mine taking it. That's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's actually pretty simple. Uh, immediately, in the immediate future, next two weeks, while I'm still here training, I'm, I'm here for about a month, right? Um, deeper understanding of the grip game, deeper understanding of the attributes we're talking about, physical attributes, uh, and, and applying them. And it's not so much techniques, although I'm constantly trying to sharpen those up, but it's better setups, better movement, better uh, creating a movement and better taking advantage of movement. Now, of course, that's why it's wrestling, right? But this is a particular way of going about it, a particular mm -hmm. mindset of going about it, particular sets of strategies of going about it that I want to start developing more. Mm -hmm. uh, this summer, I'll be back. I'll be doing, I'll be competing in Nottoms and uh, I want to both for my own, uh, to, 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 to validate for myself and to build my own confidence in this competitively, as well as to earn people's uh, respect and admiration. 